Welcome back to the Dividend Stacker Investing Channel. Today, we're going to talk about how I got assigned 16,000 shares of SoFi. I sold puts last week, and they got assigned, and I'll show you what happened. So first, let's look at the portfolio. We're down 2%, or almost like 3%. On the weekly, we're down 8%, or 13,000. On the month, we're down 1% or 1,500. On the three months, we're up 15% or 19,000. Year to date, we're up 55%. Man, I remember when it was like 75%. But I gotta show you the losses with the wins. And the year, we're down 48,000 or 25%. All time up 73%. So, I got some hood calls on Robin Hood at $20 strike price, 132 hood calls. I'm down on those right now, but I'm down about 2,000 bucks or 15%. But we got them for 2025. Yeah, January 17th, 2025. So we got a lot of time on those leaps. So I got 16,000 shares of SoFi now. 16,000 shares of SoFi. Down 13% or $19,000. Pretty much $20,000. But SoFi is a good company that should be profitable this year. So once it becomes profitable, it should run. But if we look, come down... So I got those 16,000 shares and then I sold the 9.5 call for 960 bucks and then I rolled it for 320 for the $9 calls. So what's that like 1200 bucks, 1300 bucks made this week. Not as much as last week where I made like 3 to 5000 but Still, an extra thousand bucks a week going to your portfolio just for selling contracts. It's pretty nice. And when, when SoFi comes back up, we'll be up a lot again. So, so sometimes when you sell puts, you're going to get assigned and you sell calls just to get them called away and get some premium. Just keep the, the, the wheel going. Sell puts, sell calls, and just keep doing it over and over and getting steady, consistent income. Well, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time on the Dividend Stacker Investing Channel.